to a developing story as dozens of people forced out of their homes, many of their possessions destroyed after a massive fire at an apartment complex. It happened early this morning near Washington and Rainbow and 13 Action News reporter Parker Collins was first at the scene. He is there now live. Parker, how's it look now? It looks a lot different than when we first pulled up this morning. You can see right now they're working on boarding up and cleaning up the building where this fire started. But when we first got here, these flames were shooting up through the roof. A lot of smoke was in the air, and right now they're saying close to 40 people cannot go home at this point. And only one person, though, had to go to the hospital. We spoke with one man who was going around, banging on doors, trying to get people to come out to safety. I feel like, man, if I can save somebody's life, that's what I'm going to do, regardless, even to put my life in jeopardy. So I want to show you something over here. This is Washington. When we first got here this morning, several fire trucks were lined up there. Right now they're gone and the scene has cleared. Reporting live, Parker Collins, 13 Action News.